Hello, everyone. This is Phoenix Tremaine, and I'm here today to give you your spoils for your favorite soap. But, but first, if you haven't done so, please take a minute to subscribe. If you have subscribed, thank you very much. I do appreciate it. Please hit that like button so YouTube knows good channel for soap fans. And give our membership a try. That would be a great birthday present for me. My uh, birthday was Friday. And uh, the membership is a great place to be. We have our live Zooms information throughout the week and you know everything that's going on and if you can also do one more thing for me check out my dream podcast i released a second episode uh today and uh there'll be a link to it at the end of this video but it's also uh part of my video so if you're a subscriber you should get that that notification but anyway I'm going to go ahead and thank my members, uh, Michael Pryor, Ariane Enos, Glenn Marie, Marlon Finn, Riri Carter, Slim Slims, Cheryl Beecher, Jay Ponson, Sandra Crawford, Janet Loftus, Chalkman 33, Denise M, Roger Smith, Kiki Landry, GH Fan, Deborah Velasquez, Heather Kite, Ramona Newson, Josh Hirsch, MJ Hano, Kim Price, uh, Susanna Rahaj, I said those names twice, Matasha M, Lisa Knapp, Demi Sun, Avara, DLC, Red Butter 550 Irish, Christy Power, Vashanti Collins, the NJ Tribe fan, Shannon Clark, Omar, Phyllis Pearson, and Kelly Banks. Thank you all for being part of the membership. Check out that dream podcast. And I will now turn this over to your favorite soap, Spoilers. Now we're going to talk about Bold and Beautiful. Which, by the way, was uh, my favorite soap of the week because uh, it, 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 I said, I didn't know they were going to go this route, but I was thinking, I didn't say it, I was thinking that Sheila was entrapment. That whole situation with Sheila was, in, Sheila was entrapment. And that is exactly how she got off. That was clearly a case of entrapment. And, you know, her lawyer could have easily argued that she said what she thought Ridge wanted, uh, uh, Bill wanted to hear, but they didn't even take it there. They just, the judge was like, it's it's entrapment, it's not legal. You, that None of that's admissible. And then the other case, there was no new evidence. So there was, she had already gotten off on that, you know, you got double jeopardy. So, there's no new information or anything to come through. So Sheila's free. I kind of feel sorry for Deacon since Deacon is uh, Sheila's love interest and how everyone is going to be hating him uh, once it's revealed that they're together. You know, Hope and Brooke and people like that are 100% not going to understand. So this is going to be a a good thing for Deacon. He's got his woman back, but it's a bad thing because he's got his woman back. So we also have for Bold and Beautiful on Tuesday, Ridge is stunned to learn a shocking new development. Of course, Ridge is stunned to learn a shocking new development because, you know, the truth about Sheila being set free is going to be like uh, hold it, Rich. Oh, I'm sorry, I read that completely wrong. Rich was at the court, he knows she's out. Rich learns of a shocking development is most likely Hope and Thomas together that Hope divorced Liam, and now she and Thomas are officially together. So, that is what that, that is. Why it encourages Liam to avoid jumping to conclusions. If you saw the promo when Sheila hugged Finn and he hugged her back. In the promo, it shows Liam pulls out his phone, he records it, and shows it to Steffi. So, uh, <laughs> so you know, I guess we're going to get a day of Wyatt, you know, telling him, don't jump to the conclusion, it's just a hug, or whatever that's going to be. Wednesday, Liam takes matters into his own hands. That's probably him showing Steffi. Deacon has a secret reunion with someone from his past, which is, of course, Sheila. Thursday, Ridge vows to protect his children. Steffi struggles with Finn's secret. So I guess now that Liam snitched and showed uh, her the video, uh, they also shown a promo, Steffi confronting Finn about, you know, leave Sheila alone. 
<laughs> just just leave her alone. Uh, Friday, July 28th. <clears throat> Steffi and Finn's day at the beach takes an unexpected turn. Liam puts everything on the line. So <clears throat> for Friday's episode, Finn takes Kelly to the beach. Finn's mother, Lee, is back. But it also says a day at the beach ends in disaster. So uh, I'm not sure what's going to happen on the beach, but if it's something doing, dealing with Kelly, most likely is going to be just one more reason for Liam to try to take uh, Finn, Steffi from Finn. In the spoilers, it also talked about uh, Liam feeling like getting Finn out of Steffi's life is to protect her and his daughter. So that's his excuse to go after Steffi again. And so now it's up to you. Let me know in the, oh, also, I can't leave without mentioning how much fun it was last week for Hope to Whip Out Those Divorce Papers. <laughs> oh, that was such a good episode. Uh, Liam was not expecting that. That, you know, she's not going to like be bouncing back and forth. She was done. She spent like three episodes in bed with Thomas. <laughs> she's good. So um, let me know what you think in the comment section. And I will see you in the next video.